Hey there, it's me, Jerry Galt, back with another video for this week. This week, I'm going to be talking, or rather showing you, the behind the scenes of making a video. So without any further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, so first of all, uh, there are going to be a few steps that I do uh, before, or before a video gets published to the YouTube channel. Alright, so first of all, I have to write the script because I don't know if I just come out here and blabber on about something it may not really be good and the video may not sound that nice and it won't be an entertaining video so I have to go on and I have to prepare the script of the video so that takes about an hour or 30 minutes approximately so I write the script or sometimes recently I use the app called voice notes to record my script and then I edit the script instead of wasting the time actually typing. So that just is a thing that speeds up the process. Otherwise that is creating the script. So creating the script is very important for me. Sometimes in really important videos, in videos where I might forget, I keep the iPad right next to me when I record. But in videos like this, it's quite easy to memorize what I have to say. So I just memorize what I have to say before or I rehearse and then I get to recording. Alright, so now for the recording the video part. Before any of the recording and the real action start, I have to set up the camera and the lights and everything like that. So this approximately only takes 5 minutes or so. And then the real action starts. I actually go ahead and record the video. So as you can see right now, I'm recording a video. So then I go on to recording the actual video itself. This one depends. Sometimes if it's a really good video, like for example if it's of me going on a trip or something like that. Like one video that I had recorded went up to 30 minutes because it was of a trip that I had gone to. Because I had so much to talk about, it was so interesting. But like if you see my last video which was about a tool called Augupin, it was a good and interesting topic to talk about but there wasn't really too much for me to keep on talking and get the video going. So that's why the video was only 5 minutes long. So that really depends. Sometimes the video takes like I said 30 minutes to record otherwise it just finishes in a simple 5 minutes. And sometimes I do mess up my videos. I'm not the perfect guy who can make the videos in the first go with no mistakes. So sometimes if I completely mess up, I have to re-record. Otherwise, if it's just a small mistake, I cut that part out and I uh, say it again in the video. And if you have noticed some cuts in my videos, that is probably why you would have seen those cuts. So that is what a uh, recording is and like i said maybe 15 30 minutes it takes to record if that is you include setting up the stand and everything like that now this is a part that actually takes all my time when uploading a video and that is editing the video so i have uh, been uh, recently improving on my editing time before I used to be taking 5-7 days for a 10 minute video. Nowadays I can make a 10 minute video in about 2 days. So this again really depends. Most of the time I can get it done in 2 days. The video like the audio pen video that I was talking about before. It took me 2 days to edit the video and upload it. So sometimes it takes one day if it's just an easy video like for example an unboxing video that i made or something else super easy to make maybe some youtube shots or something like that something very easy i can finish it in about a day maybe a video that's only two minutes long 
or I don't have to edit too much of it and it's only mainly me talking. Overall, I would say it takes a decent amount of time, about a day or so and it depends on what editing style I go for. Sometimes I go for a, f a very hard editing style that is what might take me 3 or 4 days uh, but uh, these days I go for a simple but uh, good editing style so that is the one that takes about 1 or 2 days for me to edit the video. Overall this is probably the most uh, time consuming part but also probably uh, the most important part of uploading a video. Next part is actually uploading the video. There are actually a few different steps in this, I believe it or not. First of all is making the thumbnail. So either sometimes I just use the Filmora app itself to make a thumbnail. Sometimes if I uh, don't have time or uh, I just prefer to go for Filmora. Otherwise, I go into Photopea, uh, the best Photoshop alternative in my opinion, except crack versions. Uh, the best Photoshop alternative and I use that to make my thumbnails. If it's on Photopea, it takes about 15 minutes because it, it takes more time to do things. But if it is on uh, Filmora, it's much easier to do it and it only takes about 10 minutes anyways then after that i go into the youtube dashboard and click upload video i put the title which either i get it myself or i ask ChatGPT to generate it for me and then second i go and i import the thumbnail that i made before and then i go into notion which is where i store everything and get the youtube description that i always use I paste it into the description and I edit some things depending on the video and then I click publish the video. And that's it for this video. This is Garrett signing off.